All right, hey you guys, I am making irrigation videos right now. So I'm pretty sure that these irrigation videos will be in two parts because I have a lot of content and it's all like worthy of sharing. I just don't wanna overwhelm someone with like a 20 minute video because I hate watching those. It like makes me tired and it's boring. So um, I'll probably split it up into the history of irrigation and the CSI farming irrigation like what we do there and then I'll probably talk about I have a video for magic seed and the irrigating we do there I did have some issues when we like we had some issues when we turned on the pump so I'm going to share that um, because it's good stuff to know and to be able to problem solve as part of your job in agriculture which I'm learning more of every day um, you never stop learning that you're never going to stop problem solving so um, with that being said in this video I will cover um, CSI, irrigation, and the history of irrigation. So basically just cover Milner Dam. Um, that's all I really know about to my extent of knowledge. And before Milner Dam, the Magic Valley was not farmed. Um, it was desert. There was no canals anywhere. Uh, the canals were dug like basically by hand and like blowing them out with explosive, explosives, I'm pretty sure. I cannot remember exactly, but um, they didn't have big machinery when they were doing this. So um, they built the dam. I drew it up here. So if this is a Snake River right here, they built this dam to stop the flow of it. So when they shut the gates on this dam, it backs up the pressure on the Snake River and sends water down the canals to the Magic Valley. So I, uh, there's like, I think there's four lines. My chair just fell over. Um, there's like four lines that four canals that come out of that and then um, one of them splits in the high line low line I'm pretty sure I don't know a lot about that but that is the line that we use for our pea field so I should know more about that and we just visited it for class but it is low this year because um, we didn't get as much snow as we needed and our water comes out of Yellowstone um, basically so it comes out of Yellowstone all the reservoirs up there comes down the Snake River there's a couple more dams that like stop it up by Eastern Idaho and then um, stuff like that. So after it gets down to the Milner Dam, that's when it splits up to water the Magic Valley, which is what I focused on in this video. And I went out to the Milner Dam and I got some footage of that so you can see it because I know that me describing it on the board doesn't always work. I got footage of what it looks like right now. The dam is closed. Um, I don't know if they ever open it or if it does open. That might seem silly. I might seem stupid for saying that, but it's fine. So with that being said, I will show you guys Milner Dam and CSI's farm and what we do for irrigation there. Pretty cool stuff. Also, I'm just going to apologize in advance for the wind. That is not something I can control and I do often forget about it. So if you can't hear me too good, just comment and ask what I was saying or something like that. Turn on your subtitles. I don't know if that'll work. But I do need to work on getting a microphone that'll clip onto my shirt or something like that for when I'm making videos because it does get windy down here in good old southern Idaho. So we do not get enough rainwater during the year to grow crops here. So we use irrigation and canals basically carry the water to your farm and then you can pump it out through a pivot and um, hand lines and wheel lines like I'm going to discuss in this video as well or you use like the ditches with the tarps i don't know i'm really bad at this but um i forget what they're called it's escaping me at the moment it's probably a really simple stupid answer but yeah so um off the dams we get hydroelectric power and then enough water to grow crops in the magic valley for all the farmers that are down here so I'm walking up to this, it was too windy to talk, so you can see the big structure in front of me. That is Milner Dam, um, and then the concrete in front of me, that's the, I'm pretty sure it goes all the way out to, I'm trying to follow it on Google Maps right now as I'm talking about this, but it goes out to the Wilson Lake Reservoir, and then over to Minidoka is what I'm following. So that could Here's be wrong, an but yeah. example of one of the diversions off of the Snake River. It comes through here and it goes up there.
video that just played about the canal that comes off the Snake River. I'll show you guys that on Google Maps because I have it pulled up right now. But that was the Gooding Milner Dam eventually, like that's where it leads to. So I'll show uh, you. This is Milner Dam. That's where I was parked. And then this was the canal that goes into Wilson Lake. And then this was the diversion that I showed you. So that's the canal. And if you zoom out and you follow that canal, it goes over here. And there's a bunch of gates right here so they can open and close these. And then if you follow this little curvy line, that was the diversion that I showed you. It goes up and over and you can see all those fields in there. And then it comes over here, keeps going and going. And if you zoom out, you can see, I guess we'll zoom in because I'm not that good when I'm talking through a screen, but holy jeepers, it goes all the way out here. Um, so you can see that little thing. They have a little, that's a road, just kidding. Let's zoom out again. We'll go some more. So you can see it doesn't take just a straight path to Gooding. Um, it goes through Dietrich, then it goes to Shoshone, and then eventually Shoshone is gonna come over here. So you can see where the canal is like. It's right there, because it's green right there. See that? How cool is that? And then it comes through Gooding. Mm, to the Little Wood River. I might have lost it, but you guys get the point. So just a little zoom out of the Magic Valley. This is the Magic Valley. You can like see the difference that the water has made. So there's Lake Walcott, Snake River, Raft River, Milner Dam's over here. And it just explodes, like pivot lines, well pivot circles, not lines, but I just think that is so cool because it all used to look like that, I'm assuming. I should get a time graph and like find it, but look at how cool that is, little magic valley. Okay, after watching that video, it's 7 minutes and 30 minutes, 30 seconds long already, so I'm just going to cut it here and put all of uh, what we do for irrigation in a different video. I think all the information in this video is useful for someone that doesn't know about the Magic Valley, how we got our water. So if that was helpful to you guys at all, just let me know. Um, hopefully it was, and that's a little bit on the history of irrigation in Idaho, Southern Idaho, Magic Valley. Woohoo!